Hola, somos Ario Toscana. Estamos aquí en Dallas, en la, el evento de revelación del R88. Lo que presentaron es algo del futuro. Como lo es Robinson, son líderes en todas las categorías que están y estamos seguros de que lo va a hacer con este R88. How this machine, this aircraft, will impact the industry of helicopters in the world? It's got a lot of really important improved safety features like a four-axis autopilot. Putting those in the aircraft standard is a huge step in the right direction. So we know how to do low-cost operations and maintenance of helicopters. So we've done a, a lot of work on the ADA to make sure that it has that same success. I think that's the kind of thing that we we really feel like is a, is a game changer for the industry, the do tourism, air medical, utility, all the like. Helicopter for 10 people, two pilots, eight passengers, different options to be able to fly, which allows you to enter to another market, another level of operations. It's really incredible. It's very big, a lot of power, different varieties of combinations to be able to work, maintaining the line of Robinson, which are low cost operational costs. La verdad que el helicóptero cumple todas las operaciones que cumplen los helicópteros más grandes y entregando la misma seguridad para todos los que lo vuelan. We want to know if it's going to have a good performance like flying in, the, in high altitude or they do different jobs. Uh, the aerial engine's great at high altitude, so we're very confident that all together this will be a high altitude machine giving folks the ability to do things like heliskiing and emergency services for for injuries in mountains. Uh, all that the aircraft will be capable of and, and highly effective at. So we expect to fly as soon as possible. The team is working very hard to make sure that happens. That's our immediate priority. And once it's in active flight testing, we'll be doing certification testing. Uh, and we expect to have these aircraft fielded around the globe by the end of the decade. So these will be a high priority for Robinson from here on.